what is the atmosphere? A covering of layers of air around the earth is called the atmosphere. The air around us exerts pressure on us as well as the earth. This pressure exerted by air on the earth's surface is called atmospheric pressure. If you take a square cardboard of 1 meter side at sea level, then the air will exert a force of 1,1400 newtons on it. That is, the atmospheric pressure at sea level is about 1,1400 newtons per square meter. The instrument used to measure atmospheric pressure is called as barometer. What will happen to pressure if we go higher above the sea level? As we go higher, the air becomes rarefied as the number of layers of air decreases. So, the atmospheric pressure decreases as we go higher. You can try this experiment as well. Take a hard boiled egg. Take a glass bottle with a wide mouth. Peel the boiled egg and place it on the glass bottle. The mouth of the glass bottle should be such that the egg remains on top of the mouth. Observe. Does the boiled egg enter the glass bottle? No. Take a match box and a paper strip. Light the paper strip with the help of the match box and place it in the glass bottle. Now quickly put the egg on top of the bottle. Observe for a few minutes. We observe that the paper strip extinguishes and the boiled egg is sucked into the glass bottle. Can you explain why? The burning paper strip heated the air inside the bottle. The air expands on heating. It comes out of the bottle. You can see air leaving the bottle by slightly pushing the air upwards. After some time, the air cools down. This cooling of air contracts the air, creating a partial vacuum inside of the bottle. This reduces air pressure inside the bottle. So now, the air pressure inside the bottle is less than the pressure outside it. Outside air pressure pushes the boiled egg inside. Now, the air pressure inside and outside are equal. Do we also experience air pressure? Yes, we do. Then why don't we feel it? This air pressure is balanced by the pressure of liquids such as blood in our body. Hence, we do not feel air pressure. You must have heard that some people bleed from the nose while climbing mountains or when they visit high mountain ranges. Why does this happen? At high mountains, the air is rarefied and the atmospheric pressure is less. But some people's blood pressure cannot adjust to the lessened atmospheric pressure. The blood comes out from the nose so that the blood pressure balances the external atmospheric pressure. Now, this atmospheric pressure is same in all directions at a point. Let us modify our previous experiment which we performed using a hard-boiled egg. Take a small peeled hard-boiled egg. Fix two matchsticks on it. Now, light the matchsticks and place the bottle inverted on the egg so that burning matchsticks are inside the bottle. Does the egg get sucked into the bottle? Yes, the egg gets sucked into the bottle, showing that air pressure is exerted equally from all directions. Do you know that cyclones are formed because of the difference in air pressure at two different places? The air starts flowing from the place at higher air pressure to the place at lower air pressure. This is also responsible for monsoons in our country, India. Is there atmospheric pressure on the moon? There is very little air on the moon. So, the atmospheric pressure on the moon is very less. The density of the atmosphere at the moon's surface is almost equal to the outermost layers of the Earth's atmosphere. This is the region where the International Space Station orbits. The atmospheric pressure on the moon is equal to almost vacuum on the Earth. 
moon's atmosphere is made of helium, argon, neon, ammonia, methane and carbon dioxide. Sodium and potassium atoms are also detected on the surface of the moon. Summary Air exerts a pressure on the surface of the earth. This pressure is called atmospheric pressure. The atmospheric pressure on the surface of the moon is almost equal to vacuum on earth. Now answer the following question. Can you light a matchstick on the moon?